just sitting back watching the Warriors game and the Cavs, and I thought I would just throw on this beat to basically let y'all know it's over for the Cavs. All you LeBron fans, I'm about to spit something real, real slight. Uh, LeBron can't win the game by yourself, by yourself. No, LeBron can't win the game by yourself. By yourself, no. LeBron can't win the game by himself. He need help. Steph gon' take over the game. And put y'all to shame. He come a dude down the lane. Y'all thought I was gon' spit, but I'm about to spit lane. LeBron can't do it all. Even though he stands six feet tall. <laughs> by yourself. LeBron can't win the team. All right, right now I'm cutting my client's hair with a three guard open, all right, which is a 3.5, and I'm going with the grain, all right? That's what WTG stands for. I'm actually gonna close the lever um, midway into cutting my client's top. Um, I did the lever open just to see what it looked like. Didn't wanna cut off too much at once, so it's better to start off uh, open then closed I'm doing a high taper. I'm gonna use my Andy Slimline Pro Li to set in my first ball guideline. I'm using the Andy Shavers to create another transition. This is a, a razor ball. Now with the lever open, you want to go up an inch. Uh, my client has straight hair, so I'm doing the flick out motion. Now I'm using the one guard open with my Austers fast fees, doing the flick out motion. Kind of the reason why I'm doing the flick out motion is because I don't want to set a, a harsh line in my client's uh, waves. You know, I just want to let everything blend naturally. Now with the two guard open, same thing, flick out. But this time I'm not really setting in a guideline. I think I went up far enough. So I'm just, you know, making sure everything blends in. Same with the three guard open, still trying to get that bulk out from the top. But I'm not going to go any higher than the three guard. Now with the zero guard closed. Flick out that middle line.
with the lever open, I'm just cleaning up that that zero guard closed and flicking out that middle line. Right now, I got the lever closed, knocking out that bottom line. There's always room for improvement, so always step back, look at your work, and do the necessary steps to perfect your fade. So I showed you the other side. I'm not gonna show you this side. I'm just gonna speed this side up. I'm using the comb to push my client's hair up to show you guys and reveal to you guys his natural line, all right? I'm not actually pushing his hairline back, but here's a couple of tips that I can show you guys to reveal the front line a little bit better. Right now I got on my two guard and I'm knocking down um, his front line. I'm doing this so that when my client brushes his hair, that he won't get this overhang you know when he when he does a brush session also uh, it just makes it better for you to see his actual natural line next I'm gonna be using my one guard and just knocking off the very tips um, this makes it real easier for you guys to see the the natural line also and it just you know it, it makes for a crisp cut
Always make sure you guys do a freehand trim, especially when it comes to waivers, because those little touches uh, makes a big difference to waivers. All right, so make sure you glide the blade, or you know, use your shear work, uh, get the little frizzy hairs off top, because again, it just makes it, it actually finish the cut. When you're done, it looks way more crisp. Alright YouTube, this is the cut, and if you like it, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button, alright? It will be greatly appreciated to my notification gang. I appreciate you guys for showing up first. Uh, I always try to make sure I read everybody's comments. Um, even though I may not always have the time to respond back, I do read most of you guys' comments and I appreciate the love. I appreciate you guys just being here, watching, learning, whatever you're here for. I really appreciate you guys. So thank you again. It's your boy 360 Jeezy and I'm out of here. Cheers.